Hello, in this dot programming video, I am going to show you the finally block. So the finally block is a little block code that is attached always to the end, if, if you want, it's an optional addition to the try block. And it is always triggered, regardless of whether or not an exception is picked up or not. So at the moment, if we run it, no exception is picked up because we can do, you know, 10 divided by five. That is fine. So if I do a finally block here, and I find the block has the keyword finally, curly braces, and we can do whatever we want in here. I'm just gonna do simple print same finally. If I run that, as you can see, that gets triggered. But what if we force it to have an error now? So 10 divided by zero will cause an error, as you can see, because this is printed out from here now. But the finally is also triggered. So if you have a piece of code that you want to be run, regardless of whether or not you know this you know is successful or fails, then the finally block is a little nice addition that you can put at the end. That's it. There's nothing more to it than that. You just piece of code that is run regardless of whether the exception is triggered or not. If you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message. And as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.